Hi, what's up, guys? Today we would like to add some rants to ThinkBook 14. It took me quite some time to open the ThinkBook 14. The screws are extremely tight, and it takes you quite a while to lift the back panel. It feels well really difficult even for me to unopen the device. If you look at the internals of this laptop, everything is so good. The 2.5 inch bay has its own cables and you just need to buy the SSD itself so you can add. It houses a 45 watt hour battery, a solid state drive, and under the silver metallic cover, there is an additional slot for memory. We today have a SK Hynix memory and we would like to add it to the laptop. It is a 8 gigabytes one. You for sure you really have to disconnect the battery first in case you break anything, cause any short circuit on the laptop. So be sure to remove the battery first, no matter what you're doing on this laptop. Now we remove the metallic cover and then install the RAM. Oh, it's slightly harder to open. Anyway, now we have it. Here is it, a beautiful black stick, 45 degrees, insert it fully to the bottom and use just one finger at the center to press it down. It will be fully secured once you hear a click sound. Now we put the metallic cover back. Now we try to test whether the memory is in a stock properly. Oh, I forgot to plug in the battery. Let me plug it in. Now it's connected already. Okay, it's now powered on. After the is connecting the battery, the Windows 10 fast boot up will lose. So do not panic. For the first boot up, it will take you quite some time. Now it's here, it shows the Lenovo logo and it's recovering the Windows OS. Okay, so we are happy now. Since if the RAM is not in uh, stock properly, you can definitely not enter the system. We see the welcome information and then into the desktop. Everything is okay. Okay, thank you for watching.